I'm Ishvira Tan, Miss Druti. Okay, so this is not a goodbye message, but this is a message that I wanted to give both of you as a reminiscent of our memories together in AOS. I honestly, I really miss wishing you both good morning, first thing in the morning. And I miss and I dearly cherish all the wise words and fruitful conversations that we had at your desk over the colorful candies, you know, the ones in your desk. Um, I really hope that wherever you both are and whatever you choose to pursue, that uh, you'll always be in good health, you'll always be around good company and you'll be enveloped in joy and lots of new memories. I miss you both, Ms. Ruthie and Ms. Shrilata, and I know AUS will too, for sure. And uh, yeah, stay safe, stay, he stay healthy and happy always and stay in touch. Good morning, ma'am. Gosh, I miss saying that so much. Um, so I recently heard that Miss Srilata and uh, Miss Dhuti are gonna leave, which is really sad. But what's even more sad and devastating is that the new batches uh, who are upcoming, they won't have you as a supervisor. Because to be honest, both of you are the best, best supervisor that A-level block can have. And um, I was fortunate enough to experience that, to be honest. Even uh, smallest things like Ms. Druthi, I know you were never my teacher, but you always helped me with my doubts. Even my entrance exam doubts, you always helped me out for chemistry. And of course, Ms. Srilata, I miss you so much. And uh, there was one thing that you said that really uh, struck to me till now, that um, uh, be in examination mode because you have to study, you have to study. Uh, so let me tell you, ma'am, that examination mode and bio have not left me <laughs> until <laughs> ever since I joined university. So thank you so much and I miss you both. Hope you're doing well. Well, it's been almost four years now and I really wish that I could do this in person. Um, I want to thank Ms. Druti first for uh, all the chemistry lessons and the classes. I wouldn't have passed my A-levels without you. Um, fortunately enough, I didn't have to touch a chemistry book after that. Um, I also want to thank Ms. Srilata for being a, such a great supervisor for, for all those in, interesting conversations that we had and for being so calm when I broke the conference room glass table. <laughs> um, on a serious note uh, to both of you, you know, I think it might not be evident or for you the impact that you have on students in the short term, but over the long term, you definitely had an impact on me and I'm sure for uh, a lot of other students as well. And that's a testament to how great of uh, teachers that both of you were and still are. And I just wanna thank, um, thank you for that. And I wish you all the best. Hi, Ms. Shilata and Ms. Juti, the most beautiful, hardworking, and of course, caring people I've ever met. I can't imagine your names to be called separately. It was always Ms. Shilata and Ms. Juti. And look, after building an amazing bond between yourselves and having a great support for each other always for so many years, together you bid farewell to the place where it all started. I will miss the office, those candies, and of course, your presence. You guys have given me a gift in a form of memories of A-levels with you guys. May God bless you with a healthy, happy life wherever you go and always remember us in your prayers. Thank you for everything. Hello everyone. Uh, hello, Ms. Shilat and Ms. Shruti. Uh, definitely two very big important names in the history of uh, A-Levels. Uh, first of all, it's been an honor for me to share a few words uh, in this short clip for you both. Second of all, I personally want to say a very, very, very big thank you to you both for being the best supervisor and vice supervisor I personally could ask for. Uh, it's been a journey of amazing memories, uh, pleasure having you both as my teachers, my superiors. And I'm pretty sure for many, you guys are just more than teachers. Uh, all I can say is have a blessed life ahead. Uh, stay safe and remember us in your prayers. Thank you. Dear Mrs. Ruthie and Mrs. Srilata, I hope you remember me. Thank you for being the coolest and the wisest teachers. I will always remember your advices about studies, life, and staying away from boys. Uh, thank you for taking the time to connect with all of your students. I'm sure you'll inspire wherever you go. 
good luck and thank you for all the memories good morning evening afternoon ma'ams <laughs> hello i hope you remember me my name is royal and um when i got the message to record this video for you i was completely in shock but um just wanted to say that although i've never been taught by either of you mr lata and ms ruti you both been my biggest supporters i would say my biggest supporters throughout my a level journey as and a2 when i still remember the first day stepping in getting my admission meeting you and everything in between right from the first day till the last day graduation day you've been my biggest supporters and you've helped me understand so much in such a less time i hope you know what impact you have on the students and we're all and i think i speak for everyone when i say we're all really going to miss you ma'am miss rita and miss ruti hi miss rita and miss ruti um we heard you guys are leaving aus and we want to say that the aerial block is not going to be the same without you you guys it really held the place together and you'll never taught me subjects but i learned a lot from you all by just observing and having conversations with you all and miss rita i don't know if you remember this but you would call me my sister's name at least 25% of my a level life here i am <laughs> So yeah, she's joining us for the video. Yes, I heard you're leaving AUS and it's such a big shock because y'all made A levels the way it is. Y'all literally shaped A levels for us and we are so grateful. I've learned from you. I've studied a lot. I've learned from you and uh, both of you and uh, I just feel bad for the ju- for the next set of students that are going to come because y'all aren't y'all aren't going to be there. So it's actually quite sad <laughs> we just want to say good luck for your futures and wherever life takes you all and stay safe and take care take care bye hello miss rilata and miss ruti the best supervisors this is something that i would say back in time and we would just laugh it off but i want you to know that i meant every single word of it You guys were truly the best and the most amazing supervisors or teachers I've ever had in my life. You were our friends. We could come to you with concerns of any type. The candies and the cookies we would get in your office would make our bad days good and our good days just amazing. When I say A levels have been the best years of my schooling life, the credit goes to both of you for providing us with just such a wonderful experience. I'm very thankful for all the support that you have provided us with and I wish you good luck and I miss you a lot. Hello Ms. Ruthie and Ms. Shilata, the deadly duo, the short and fast you one and the tall and calm one, the perfect pair. Um both of you together and individually have played a huge role in guiding and steering us during the most decisive years of our lives. and i think i speak for everyone who's had the privilege to be taught by you when i say that a huge chunk of our professional and behavior growth can be attributed to you too because you both were quite simply there for us and i cannot even begin to fathom the number of students who have been impacted by your grace and tutelage and for that no amount of gratitude would be enough but still i hope a thank you would suffice and wherever the road ahead leads you both i hope it's one filled with joy and blessings thank you I'm Sturti, I'm Shweta. Um firstly, it's very saddening to hear that both of you are retiring from AUS. And it is even more saddening that these few words can be shared with you in person. But here goes. Um firstly, I want to say a heartfelt thank you for both of you for pointing me in the right direction through all the mischievous things that I had done. and attempted to do while studying under your supervision and if i'm not wrong i had only done chemistry in ace level miss smith with miss durthi and i had never actually done any subject with miss shrilata but you both always ensured and believed in me no matter what i did and i can't emphasize enough how the qualities that you both enriched in me had carried forward and helped me in the last 4 years in both my professional and academic lives and it is because of teachers like you who lay strong foundations and students like myself and many others that we are able to accomplish the goals that we set for ourselves to date 
and I believe I speak for all the other students when I say this, that the work that you both had done in the short duration that we spent with you both had greatly impacted us and we will forever be in debt and grateful for that. I wish you both the best of love for your future and I pray to God that he may bless you both in your journeys. Hey everyone, especially to my lovely supervisors, Ms. Sheila and Ms. Truthi. So I'm recording this on the 21st of June 2021 and three years ago today was the very last time I came to school as a student. It was my last day in A-levels, so it's kind of nice to speak to you again in some way uh, three years later on the same day. I'm very happy to know that you're off to start new beginnings, but uh, at the same time, I'm a little sad, uh, selfishly because I don't see myself coming back to AUS anytime soon. And as I sat here to record this, I was reminiscing the highlights of my time in A-levels. And the first thing that came to my mind was being a member of the student council for two consecutive years under your tenor. And uh, Ms. Rilata, Ms. Ruti, uh, I want you to know that I really enjoyed the times you would entrust me and uh, give me the responsibility to carry out certain tasks, whether it be uh, so-and-so happened, could you come up with something for the assembly for today, uh, could you make this announcement, uh, could you host a farewell, um, could you make sure Abdullah Poolwala doesn't go anywhere near the 13A girls class, uh, uh, things like that. I don't know if you know this, but I never took any of that as a burden. I took it filled with a lot of gratitude and it was truly an honor and privilege. I'm very grateful to you for all the opportunities that you have uh, granted me, um, whether I, if I had suggestions or there were times when I wanted to do something a certain way, whether it be an ethnic day performance or an assembly that I wanted to conduct on my own. Uh, I'd come up to you and you would listen and you would let me run with it. I really treasure all of that. And it's something that I'll always remember. I can honestly say one thing with all my heart that it was the best time of my life and I sincerely thank you for being a huge part of it. As you move on to this next chapter in life, I wish you peace, love, health, success and goodness at every step of the way. Thank you. <laughs>